Hey guys, it's Lindsay over at Mama Schmo's Reviews, and in this video, I am doing a collab with Ingrid from Mommy and Mia Chronicles, along with some other ladies. So check down below the playlist of all the ladies doing this collab. It's called Homeschool Revelation, and she gave really cool questions, 10 questions to answer today. So question number one is to share your number one goal for the homeschool year. My goal is to establish a fun environment for my kids and make really fun memories, enjoy learning and not speeding through the year and teaching them things that they might not want to learn just back off a little bit. I really want to enjoy our year and capture the moments. So that's my number one goal is to make it fun and I want them to really enjoy doing school. Number two um, is question is what is your favorite thing about homeschooling and what is your least favorite thing about homeschooling? Well, it is my second year and my daughter is in kindergarten, so my favorite thing about homeschooling is to be able to teach her the way she likes to learn and to have it more child-led and flexible to our schedule as a family. And the least favorite thing about homeschooling, I really don't have a least favorite thing about homeschooling because I love homeschooling so much, so I really can't answer that. The only thing that comes to my mind is just always being with your kids, but that's what I chose when I decided to homeschool and when I decided to become a parent is that I'm going to be with my kids all the time. So that's the only thing is you never have a chance to do things on your own because you're always with them, but I think it's a, a really big blessing for me. I enjoy being with my kids. Number three, will you be using any outside resources, tutoring, co-ops? Yes, we will be doing a co-op this year if it works out. Um, I went ahead and registered a few weeks back, so we'll see how it goes. They have a group for my daughter in kindergarten, and I think some of the moms have some young ones too. So it's a little um, area that they rent out in the library. They meet every week, so it'll be fun. I've met some of the ladies, and I think it'll be a good fit for our family. Question number four, what is your biggest pet peeve about homeschool? I really don't have one. <laughs> I know I'm not really helpful with these answers. I don't really have a homeschool pet peeve um, at all, so I have to pass that one. Number five, what are some of the new things that you'll be doing this new homeschool year that you didn't do last year? Well, we are using a separate or a different curriculum than we used last year. We started off with Heart of Dakota and we slowly went into like unit studies and then kind of got into our own groove of things and I explained that in a video of mine so I will link that up above if you want to check that out but this year we are so fortunate to get the opportunity to work with Bookshark and we're trying that out so it's different um, we're reading more chapter books with my daughter and less picture books I mean we're still reading picture books but with my daughter we're incorporating chapter books so that is something very very new in our homeschool and we've been reading those books this summer and it's really been working out well. She's using her imagination and she's really enjoying those books. So that's something different that we'll be doing this year. Number six is reflecting on last year's homeschool year. What are some things that I learned about myself? I learned that I'm crazy that I actually research and research and research until I can't research anymore. And then I take a break and then I research more because I really enjoy le learning about homeschool like methods and things that my kids will be liking. And since, it's my, since it was my first year last year, I was really into researching and I spent so many sleepless nights researching on homeschool and what I can do in my homeschool and how to incorporate things and since I was so new to it it was just a really fun thing to to research so that was something that I found out about myself I just went non-stop really full force into just trying to figure out what was best for my family and I'm kind of crazy that's what I learned about myself last year just to be honest with you guys what were some misbeliefs that I told myself when I was homeschooling. There's no misbeliefs that I told myself in regards to homeschooling because I know with homeschooling it's a learning process, especially for the first year and I've watched a lot of YouTube videos and I've gotten a lot of encouragement on there so I knew not to put pressure on myself. So um, that's definitely something that I learned from watching you guys, you all you guys on YouTube, is to just relax and take it easy on yourself. If you were to look at yourself in the mirror, what truth would you tell yourself? Um, I would just tell myself in the mirror is that all things are possible with God and 
this is gonna be a fun and exciting year. Question number nine is talking about you planned out your school year by week, by days, by months, and question about, the question asks, did you schedule your own personal me time? Why or why not? All right, so I don't really plan my own personal time. I basically am so blessed to have my mom close by, so we always try, my husband and I try to go out on a date at least once a month, and then the girlfriends that I have we always try to do like a girls night out once in a while so I don't plan it per se I know that it's something that I need to do for myself so I don't go crazy and um, it's really really helpful to have a great mom to watch my kids when I need her to and a great husband that lets me go out and have fun with my girlfriend number question number 10 I'm almost done you guys is what is your favorite thing to do that has nothing to do with homeschooling meal planning homemaking well, I would say YouTube. I love YouTube because I just enjoy um, talking to you all and listening to your YouTube videos and gaining encouragement. I also love singing and writing music um, if I ever get a chance to, if I'm ever alone. That's another thing that I'd like to do. And hanging out with my friends and my family as much as we possibly can because I do live close to my family and friends and it's really nice to get together and just hang out and chill and relax with them so those are my answers for those 10 questions thank you so much ingrid from um, mommy and mia chronicles for inviting me to do this is really fun if you guys want to do this collab yourself you're welcome we will add you to the playlist and um, and I'll have the 10 questions down in my description list that you guys can answer for yourselves. And I hope you guys have a great homeschool year. I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.